but brought to you by Chester's Popcorns. Last week's episode brought to you by Funyuns. Well, I think the uh, right right now is the unique opportunity to address rerun watchers. Hello, rerun watchers. Because uh, only rerun watchers could be watching this early in the show because because there's like a delay. I don't know if it's like a minute delay or. But uh, so nobody knows we're on yet except people watching this and rerun. I'm a rerun watcher. I love watching. What about the people who are on your page refreshing it every second, just waiting? It's still a delay. There must be people doing that because we get them. So they, they, do, they do come in right away. Well, I think they, they probably follow and then it tells them right away. In case you are a, well, you are a rerun watcher, because I could see nobody's on yet. Um, you may already know that this is Lounge Academy. We're broadcasting out of uh, downtown Buffalo, New York, on a Friday, because that's what we do every Friday. And uh, for the next nearly four hours, we're going to be exploring the great American songbook, the whole thing. The whole thing, along with a panel of experts. We don't know who they're going to be yet. I think, I think uh, Mary Kate O'Connell um, indicated she was coming tonight. Two weeks in a row. That would be two weeks in a row. Yeah, she's a couple makeup weeks because she missed a few. Is her friend Darlene coming? I hope so. Because I want more Funyuns. You want more what? Funyuns. Funyuns from Darlene? Yes. And uh, yeah, just checking to make sure uh, this was public. I see someone coming across the street who looks very much like Karen Lizzie. I'd say that's Lizzie. Since nobody's watching yet, in real time, uh, this will be the part of the show where I wrestle with my tablet computer. In the optimistic hope that I'll be able to watch live so I could see the viewers' comments and song requests. Lizzie's here, ladies and gentlemen. This is usually the hardest part. Fortunately, this is the hardest part of all this technology, is just me being able to watch the show from the from the piano. It says there's six people watching, but it doesn't show anybody. You know what? I still have it. But I had an email a long time ago. I should write to him and just say, look, we just have a I don't trust it. And Mary Kane will Here it is. Yeah, it was lying. David Shire. Now people are watching you, watching you. Yeah, the joke's on me. Yeah, Shirley Mayer. Shirley Mayer, hi, Shirley. Watching now I can see you guys. Watching Barbara you. Fisher, Big Mike Wozinski. How you doing, sir? Nice to see you, champ. Betty, we got a great, great group of people. GT. GT Eckel. Lizzie, uh, George Apple says hi. Lizzie, she's, she's engrossed. George Apple says hi to Lizzie. Ryan says hi to George Apple. George Apple says hi to Lizzie. Hi, George. Come on down. She said hi back. Hi back. Come back. Hi back. You had a little story the other night. 
Okay. Oh, yeah, so that's working. So now it's just a matter of the usual struggle with the uh, thing here. So I like it to work because I like to see people's comments immediately and, and right while I'm playing without having to look at another computer. So it's, so it's pretty handy. Here we go. My wishes were answered. Kathy Kirby McGuire's out there. This is great, my old school chum. Nice to see you, Kathy. It's too early in the night for something that isn't in 4-4, Michael. We used to do that. I think I did that when I went to school with Kathy Kirby. We used to do take five. I used to play that in a, in, because they made me, and it was a great, great song. I'm trying to remember how it goes. It's before the lottery game in the candy bar. And they took up our Before the lottery and the candy bar. Yes. That was a long time ago. I mean. It's really old, very, very old place. It just doesn't. <laughs> it's a great title. Come to me. Maybe I'll, I'll try to fake it. Good evening, Kathy. Adjust everything. So we'll be. It's great you took your dad. The bugs crawling out of here. Walked in there at 5 o'clock. 4 people in there. Yeah. Peter was big. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
shoulder cam. In case you have requests and you, you, you request a certain camera angle, you can, you can do that. And um, this is called the fire cam. And, and right now you're looking at the VIP table. Not to be confused with the fart cam. Go here and leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Oh, yeah. I left one at the Eagle House. No, <laughs> what happened? They mailed it back to me and said, don't do that again. <laughs> No, don't confuse it with that. And you can see we've got uh, Alan, our most senior lounge cadet, is with us tonight, which is fantastic. He's on your left. And um, so that's the far cam. It, it's, they're easy to remember. Oh, I think uh, Paul Kokoda might be at the door. Oh, well, I better answer it. Which is really makes it the official. Oh, here he is. He went back. He was getting. He was getting. Uh, he's carrying a bag of like huge subs or something. This is the hair cam. It's easy to remember because I named it that because I could check my hair to make sure my part is okay before we start the show. And that's that's a really good part today. That's a good sign. Yeah, the, no, this is that thing up again. Right? <laughs> 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 if I get told nice to me when I did a story of Howard does broadcast, you never know. He plays if he's in town. Very sketchy. Maybe we should do a DVD. Of these you know, I'm sorry. I have to name You're watching Lounge Academy. Just you and me. On a kind of everyone's over there. Here comes Ryan, president of WBIG. It's a nice bow tie you're wearing. Why, thank you. Have, have I seen that before or not? I have. But I'm a guy. See, I don't notice things. We're home. It's from the, where did Mary Kay come from? And she's got a dog in her purse. I know. I don't know. It came with a bag. Ladies and gentlemen, Mary Kay will come out. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. One and only Rosie. There she is. She's promoting the show. Lounge Academy is courtesy of uh, the Statler yeah. Hotel. Do they know? Yeah, <laughs> they, they do know. Yeah, no, they, uh, they know. <laughs> nice to see you, Paul Kokoda. There's uh, chicken wings up there. Oh, that's one? fantastic. Well, I'll uh, take a little chicken wing break in a little while. Maybe, uh, you know what I'll do? I'm, I'm going to be smart. I'm going to take... I'm going to say, be smart and take some. Take, take your... Uh, take a few and your appropriation. Good move, Howard. Yeah. You learn things. <laughs> yeah. Through trial Chicken and error. Disappear quickly. So then you have to actually work at retaining the things you learn. Yeah, well, that's a whole Not one of my strokes. So, Paul, I saw your phone last night. I ran into him. Yeah, I know. It was funny. It was nice. It was good to see you. That chicken wing just just grease on my hands just from getting near those things. I love that. Makes your hands move faster. Can you introduce me then? Oh, it's really fun. If you're on guns, we can have you. We went to. I'd like to say hi to Bob. Bob, hi. Oh, Bob Howitz is here, ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to say hi to Margaret Sullivan. Hi, 
our newest lounge cadet. She's actually one of our oldest lounge cadets because she really got in on the ground floor of Lounge Academy a year, years ago and we, we had some musical gatherings at the house, right Margaret? Good thing I grabbed my three. Show Bob where everything is. Bob Helwitz, and he brought his date, Lisa. Welcome, Lisa. Mary, uh, Margaret, um, oh, Mary's, she's doing her thing, you know, she's hosting. Mary Margaret Sullivan says hi. Sponsors here and keeps the lights on so far. If you need your car fixed, just give us a call and tell the Lounge Academy will hook you up with Buffalo. If you're downtown or in North Buffalo, we've got courtesy, courtesy locations. Yeah, we actually paint painted on their car. <laughs> Upper stickers stickers are unreliable. And if you're so and if you're hungry, we get real shy. Yeah. We get real shy to paint them on your car. <laughs> Remember real shy? Yeah. <laughs> Paint any car for like what 20 bucks or something? Yeah, yeah. Cash. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you didn't really need a loan. I only need cash. No relation to David Shire. Or Irv Shire. What's the what of the book? History, history of this building. Oh well. I don't even know it all. It was um it was already here in the 1850s, and there was a yeah, there was a silversmith here in the 50s and 60s. And I've, and I've got I've got his forks. I've got four of his forks that he made. Wow. Yeah, a guy in his name was Hiram Hotchkiss from Connecticut. The Connecticut Hotchkisses. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was uh, the next guy was Thomas Lothra and he uh, he was I think the first director of the psych center of the H.H. Richardson and the place was brand new I guess you know it's hard to imagine that place being new all the nuts were new and what was your tenants he was a physician. He 
He was also, he was a, uh, he was, you know what? He was the director of the psych center, but they didn't call it the psych center at the time. It was the insane asylum. He might not have been the first. He was the first, he was either the first director of the insane asylum or the first. I love the first time. There were other doctors. Oh, oh, you know something about this? That's crazy. Okay, because he was a he was he was a Buffalo school superintendent as well. He died in this house. Where, where Bob's sitting. Here they come, ladies and gentlemen. This handsome man and Alfie. For some musical surprises, a little later in the end. We never know what the show is going to be about. Jay Anderson's out there. How are you, sir? The next president of the United States. Frank de Cesare says hi to all the fellow lounge cadets. He's our documentarian. Frank's in Florida. I finally got that straight. Sarasota. We're going to rename it Sarah de Cesare. Is that a bar? I, I did not. No. It's from the historic gay bar that was here. If it was nicer, I'd take credit for it. This is Sia Gaia. Jay says hi to Bob. We'll be doing whatever we're doing here till 11 o'clock, Buffalo time. If you convert that to uh, out of dog years, that would uh, still be 11 o'clock. <laughs> Nice to see Alfie eating. He's going to have a piece of our own uh, signature steaming hot loaf. It's 100% whole wheat. <laughs> A little dab. It's like real cream. A dab will do you. It is. It's all it takes. I put a little real cream on tonight. Is that it? All right, here's one. 
wonder if it's in here. It's in one of them. Yeah, it's in one of them. This thing is falling apart. They're losing pages. They all are. Yeah, that's... I was going for a few the other day. Yeah, it makes it, makes it a little more challenging. I think it starts with easy or it's? It's. It's? It is? Oh, oh then maybe it's in the... Uh, that's the part I always have trouble with using the alphabet. It's knowing which which letter of the alphabet you're actually is. That's a great one right there. I'll string along with you. That's uh, How do you even see that? You can see it. I can't even see it. Oh, right here. That was uh, Harry Warren. That's, that was a favorite of But he recorded that. It's very exciting. It's very And it's just Okay, it's not in this one. But, uh, yeah. This is one. Hey, I was using this as a bookmark. See if we can find it. Well, you're eating chicken wings. So that's not a good idea to go through. Go through the tomes. That's a good one. That's a good one, Jay. Yeah, we'll get to that one for you. Mary, come back in the room. 
to see if there were numbers. Because they put numbers on the inside of their ties, so he'd say, tonight we're wearing 16. <laughs> I, I did not know that. Yeah. Th this was Joe's. See if there's a number on the inside. Now, I, I inherited Joe's ties, but I did not inherit this tie. This tie has its own story. Um, Judge Martucci had that big party. You were there, you were performing. Yeah, yes, yes. And, um, Jocko had been giving me his ties, and uh, he, he was all excited about the party, and he invited me, wanted, he was, he was actively, you know, teaching me at the time, you know, so he said, I want you to play at the party, I want you to do sets between us, okay, you know, you know, so, okay, and, uh, he said, we got to have matching ties, because he and Joe always have matching ties. That's right. So, so he, gave me, he gave me this. He says, wear, wear the red tie for the party. There's no number inside? No, there's no number. He, they, he must have dropped the numbering system in recent years or something. I could look. I've got, I've got tons of his ties. Just take a look, because he, he showed I will. you. open up the, the, the live part, and it has a number. I always love it. Well, I'm going to definitely look through those times. So, so he wanted the Joe and me and 
Chocolate Rain matching ties for his for his Judge Martucci party at the Hyatt. So he said, wear this specific tie, right? Okay. And then he, you know, they they'd wear theirs. So I I presume, you know, that was the whole idea. So we get there, we've all got red ties on. Joe's tie was a different red tie. Jocko had given me Joe's tie. I felt, you know, I, I felt kind of, kind of cool actually. What a wonderful party, though. Judge was, Judge Martucci was such a great guy to do that. He is a Yeah. 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 What a big heart that guy's got. Yeah. But uh, it was so, such a beautiful evening. I mean, you and Maria, yeah, it was just Jocko and Joe just sitting there basking in the music and loving it. It was, it was a great night. Jack, uh, Joe's the first one that told me to drink apple cider vinegar for our bread. Because he had that poor, oh. crippling art. You know, I think, the, I think the thing about apple cider vinegar is it. It'll fix or cure anything. It will, and, 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 and it might cure your popularity because it's a little fun. <laughs> I use it for fruit fly traps. So. Yeah, and it's amazing. Yeah. You know, like an album you can do. Yeah, it is really good. I could go on, I could tell you some things. <laughs> but I won't right here because it's save that for the medical show. Does it matter if it has the mother? Oh, the mom. I think that's BS. I think that's to sell that expensive stuff. But I can't be certain. Is that the one I gave you? It is. This goes out to re by request. Oh, Kokoda.
I hear you whisper. I'll always love you. I know it's over. And yet, it's easy to remember. So hard to forget. So I must dream to have your hand caress me fingers press me tight I'd rather dream than have you only feeling stealing through the night each little moment is clear before me and though it brings to me regret it's easy to remember so hard to forget and hearts. Boy, what a beautiful song. Amazing. That air conditioner is doing a pretty good job. Yeah. Yeah. Right, let me know if it gets too cold. Tom Lewandowski, nice to have you back at the lounge, sir. Wonderful to see you. Yeah, reboots will solve any problem, George. I agree. It only happens. When I dance with you, that trip to heaven, till the dance is through, with no one else having quite so near. Why does it happen, dear? Sounds like a Fred Astaire, Astaire sound, doesn't it? Two cheeks together can be oh so divine. But only when those cheeks are yours and mine. I've danced a dozen others the whole night through. But the thrill that comes is spring. And a dark guy happened That only happened with you Irving Berlin from uh, Easter Parade. Judy Dark? You didn't know first, or you just... I knew there was Irving Berlin. I didn't know that. 
Uh, Barbara Fisher is listening to us in Target with her ear pods on. Barbara Fisher is a cool multitasker. She's, she has the most ingenious ways of not missing the show. She was in a cab last week That's right. in New York on her way to um, the, uh, what room, where was she going? The, the big room. Yeah. Bobby Short's room. Oh, she was going to the Carlisle. On her way to the Carlisle. Right. Watching us. Was that, uh, was that? Yeah. The door? No. Oh, okay. People are just falling, so. That's good. We don't want you to multitask. <laughs> we want you to single task. Mary Kate O'Connell. Oh, Mary, we should have an O'Connell. That was darling. I just, 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 I don't let me be on with me. And you won't believe me. I love you only. I'd rather be lonely. Happy with somebody else. Steaming hot roll? Yeah, I make that. Thank you. Forget the, get the book first. Marry the book. Paper towels. I did this once. In the context of calamities of my life, this is not. Oh, yeah. The things that, the, one time I was here and I dropped, and I put over a whole glass of red. This is not the first time. It's not the first time I've done it. Jack Morho is with us. Mary Kate says hi. Yeah, he's got a great, great voice, doesn't he? So many great songs, Paul Dakota. Fakes. 
But with you there by my side, I'll soon be turning the tide. Just wait. Long as I've got arms that cling and talk, it's you that I'll be clinging to. All the dreams I dream, beg and borrow, some bright tomorrow, they all come true. All my bright tomorrows belong to you.
arms and heal me. Inside me to make my heart and dreams come true. substitution. This heart of mine was doing very well. The world was fine. As far as I could tell. Suddenly I met you and I dreamed of when I woke up singing Sentimental overture This heart of mine Is dancing gaily now I taste the wine Of real romancing now This crazy world is taking out A wonderful design as long as life endures, it's yours, this heart of mine. It's nice to see Diane looking in from Toronto. Buddy, handsome man is here. This heart of mine is dancing gaily now. I taste the wine of real romancing now. This crazy world has taken on a wonderful design. As long as life in yours, it's yours, this heart of mine. sent me a message. Dan. Diana Woodruff says hi from Toronto. Diana Woodruff, yeah. Handsome Dan says hello. He really, his eyes uh, perked up there. Scott McCausa, nice to see you, sir. We're having a ball with Alan tonight. Missy's out there. Nice to see you. Dr. Barry. And Joan Blum. All the lounge cadets are here tonight. This one goes out to Teresa and Paul Henry. It's a, it's a double. Oh, is somebody here? Apparently. Is that the... Your bouncer says there is. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, you want to see? Is that the dorm? Yeah. There's nobody there. Nobody's there? No, I'm thinking she's barking at Dan. Oh, okay. Dan was... Well, tell her to stay in line. We all I don't blame her. This day and age we're living in 
Cause for apprehension, speed and new invention, things like third dimension. No matter what the progress, what may it be proved, the simple facts of life are such, they cannot be removed. <laughs> we're getting wrong numbers. That means we're getting big. It was a rap, it was a rap singer who wanted in. You must remember this. A kiss is just a kiss. A sigh is just a sigh. The fundamental things apply. As time goes by, And when two lovers move, they still say, I love you. On that you can rely. No matter what the future brings, as time goes by. Jealousy and hate. Woman needs man. Man must have his mate. No man can deny. It's still the same old story. Fight for love and glory. Case of do or die. Academy goes by. <laughs> Not by stars, 
but just by you. Jenkins is too. You are a lounge cadet on account of your watching. It's automatic. Because we're a lounge academy. Have I ever heard it? You might have. Howard does that song downtown. Howard's to do it. Oh, you got to downtown. I don't know. We played around that. I sing it like four songs. Yeah. 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 Because it's mine. Okay, good. <laughs> then I, I use your side. I don't really know if I'm both play. Okay, good. Pull off the ball. When I move on. And life is making you the way you have always gone. Downtown. When you got worries, all the noise <laughs>
Rapper downtown himself, Dave Graham. Mr. Graham. That's right, Mr. Entertainment. Glad you came by. Great surprise. You never know who's going to walk on. They don't tell us. I said that in mass and said, where I'm going to be. A lot of people have heard it. Word must have leaked out. something here I'm supposed to be playing all this. You look the 
Yeah, yeah beautiful song. That was just for Paige, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. With, with lots of assistance from Dave Brand. Dave Brand goes to the band. It's a stage band. Five to seven. Okay. Oh, good. Good. Okay. Oh, good. Great. That's a great idea. If anybody's freezing their ass off, just let me know and I'll turn the air conditioning up. That could be a big problem. Seems pretty chilly to me, but I don't mind it. No one looks like they're suffering. You can usually tell if people are shivering. This is the end. Oh, beautiful friendship. It's a song that Rosie and Dave are singing to each other right now. This is the end. It's just this is the end. That's his funny. Of a beautiful friendship. That's for Facebook Live. Sure is. This, this is the end of a beautiful friendship. So, Bob Davis is in the room, ladies and gentlemen. We were always like sister and brother. Till tonight when we, we looked at each other. That was the end of a beautiful friendship. And just the beginning of
Dave Graham, thank you so much for doing a walk on. He'll be back. He's He's nice nice. Nice. How about another big hand for Dave Granville, ladies and gentlemen? One of the founders of Lounge Academy. It was founded by Dave Granville, Jackie Jocko, and, uh, and myself. Yeah. In 2011. And your humble books. Yeah. That was before I fixed the place up. Before we remodeled. That's where we extended the TV green stuff to 12.30, 1 o'clock in the morning. my time. That's the kind of guy I am. Others grow dizzy. I'm keeping busy. I'm biding my time. Next year, next year, something's bound to happen. This year, this year, I'll just keep on napping. Time. That's the kind of guy I'm. There's no regret when you're sad. Bide my time. It's for tinkle. Let me wet me. Dream like Rip Van Winkle. He's biding his time. And like the Winkle guy. Chasing flies. How the day flies. By my time. Gershwin and Gershwin. No wonder it's so clever. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Bob Davis. A lot of big names here tonight. All the big names in fact. Katie Myers might come by. That'd be big. We'll have... Room. Room. room for two room every day is a holiday because you're married to me not like Smoke my pipe away. Your wee head upon my knee. We will drive on, keep alive on. Nothing but kisses with Mr. and Mrs. I'm with a good chair. So, true, so. Robinson Crusoe, not so far from worldly cares as our blue far away upstairs. Rosie is transfixed on Bob Davis. She's never seen a rubber chicken before. 
she could smell it. Halloween's in the house. And she brought a big thing of dog biscuits. Someone just stuck on the dog. Darlene.
to Susan. Susan Ruby. Nice to see you in the lounge. Nice to see you relaxing. With a drink in one hand and a pet in the other. Just going to mix them up. You're watching World Academy. How are you? Nice to see you. I had a feeling it was going to be a tribute to Chaco. It always is. Oh, I'm 
great all time class that's called. Thank you. Catherine Lucas, I just wanted to show you how Catherine, Miles with Howard Golden. Nice Catherine you. Lucas was just with Michelle Tripper's friend Therese. We've met Therese before, but it was a while ago in the blue there. In ah, the, that's the where we know Therese. Yeah, Catherine, they were just having dinner at the Buffalo Club and they came here. Oh, so, great. You look like you had a nice evening so far. Let's get lost. Let them send out a warm. And though they'll think us rather rude, let's tell the world we're in that crazy mood. Sentimental, so I walk in the rain. I've got some habits, even I can't explain. Good start for the corner, turn up in Spain. Why try to change me now? I'll sit and daydream. I've got daydreams galore. Cigarette ashes. There they go on the floor. I'll go away weekends. Weave the 
Jump in his DC three and head home. Yeah. 
It's always great playing for an all show business audience. They understand the pain of the creative process. Usually that joke goes over better. I tell them every week. The days, days of wine and roses laugh and run away like a child away through the meadowlands toward a closing door, a door marked nevermore. That wasn't there before. A lonely night discloses just a passing breeze filled with memories of a golden smile introduced me to.
When I am tired of dreaming Then I'll be tired of you This I know is true When winds grow tired of blowing, grass is tired of growing, then I'll be tired of you. is right till the birds refuse to sing beyond the years the echo of my only love will still be whispering whispering if my throbbing heart should ever start repeating that it is tired of beating then I'll be tired of you The singer, where I got that from, her and Dudley Moore on his show, Miriam Montgomery. She's a big uh, uh, UK star. Back in the, you know, she was great. Yeah. Yeah. He was. He was. Beyond that. Yeah. Handsome Ben, I got your, uh, I got your stuff. Handsome Danny's opening his, uh, his T-shirt. <laughs> oh, looks like it was inspected. There was an inspection tag in there? It better have been inspected. Inspected by number All of, a sudden they, all of a sudden, they got a gig and they're out of here. Mark Harris? Where is he? Where's he playing? The anchor. Do me a favor. I miss him. How old Fred's brother says hello? Fred's brother. She'll do it. Thanks, Howard. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Enjoy it. I'd like to thank Alfie, Susan Peters, Alfie, and handsome man, ladies and gentlemen. Paul 
Coca-Cola? What's it all about? Alfie. Is it just for the moments we will? What's it all about when you sort it out, Elfie? Are we meant to take more than we give? Or are we meant to be kind? And if only fools are kind, Elfie. And I guess it is wise to be cruel. And if life belongs only to the strong, Elfie, what will you when on an old golden rule as sure as I believe there's a heaven above our feet. You don't have to know anything because you can read. Yeah, I can read it if I kind of read it. In the minor is a higher tone of the recording studios, right? Yeah, yeah. After I do the horror, you'll make me look bad. A foggy day is kind of fun. Yeah, I can't transpose. I know. That's why I'm looking at the camera. You could. You made a mental note of that. I did. I'm like, what's the lowest note? Jones. Someone said as we shook hands, 
she was just Miss Jones to Bob Davis. Then I said, Miss Jones, you're a girl who understands. I'm a man who must be free. And now at once I lost my breath. All at once was scared to death. All at once I only earth and I own the sky. Now I've met Miss Jones. And we'll keep on meeting till we die. Miss Jones and I surprise tonight. So glad to see you guys. Good night, everybody. I love using face books and real books going up. The keys are always like four steps too long or five steps too long. It's okay. I can sing it out there. Well, this is going to be good. You're going to be good. Ready? Yeah. I could cry so to tears Where have I been all these years? Little while, tell me now How long has this been going?
kiss me twice Then once more That makes three Let's make four What a great For heaven's sake Let's find one more. Okay. You you pick it. Let's <laughs> oh, thank you, Bob Davis. Appreciate that. I just tried to stay out of the way. Piano was really a defensive game, you know. what you don't do. Could you care? No, I just, yeah. 
for a cunning cottage so we could share the world will part as my mush on a kind of I've got a crush pity minor What do I want to do? I don't know. I gotta look at the book. Oh, you want to just go off? off book. You want to? It's just a book. It's in the book. Oh yeah. Um, do you see that post?
Yeah. Yes, you can. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Some more, Katie. Katie. That was beautiful. Thank you. Don't Don't stop. Come on, Trace. Look at some music. Oh, my goodness. Come on. You got to get up there. Come Come on. on. Don't you pay me. Who's the next victim? Do they have a scale? 
How often they have a scale? A scale? Often, they, yeah, they, their songs contain a scale. It's sort of like a... Oh, okay. A grace? No, just a scale. They're going to just a <laughs> scale, like a fish. <laughs> a weight scale. The rat's heart and Ira Gershwin I don't are see a scale considered on this one. the most uh, creative verses. Uncreative? No, creative. Oh, creative. The opposite of Aside from John Belby, of course. Well, John Belby is like the police say it's not creative. It's a very nice. It's like those impossible words. Very nice song. You got to hold the dog when you sing. I got to hold the dog. Yeah. I got to. I got to see the words as well. Yeah, I know. That's the tricky thing about all this. Stuff. I know, right? <laughs> Rosie will sing. Rosie's a good harmonizer. Yeah, Rosie's got those high notes. She does. She's very talented, you know. She gets all that. Don't sing, you've got a friend. That's what she does. Not as good as Pepper, though. Yeah, that's the lady. Lydia, oh Lydia. Lydia, oh Lydia. Lydia, they have to Lydia. So, where are all these cameras that you have this whole They're, um, this, the, there's, that's the corner cam. Oh, wow. And oh, then there's, this so is the hair you, cam. What do you do with all these cameras? The window we're, cameras. we're streaming live. You are not. Yeah. yeah. Oh, to, the, to the yeah. police station. Lounge Academy. Don't worry. Yeah. Just, yeah. It's just on my Facebook. You can pick your friends. You're, you your friends. you're streaming Profile. on your Facebook? You yeah. We do it every Friday night. That's why you know no one's watching. I, I did not know this. We could do anything wrong. We press We could do anything wrong. <laughs> no one will know. Okay. Is that high? Um, whatever it is, you're stuck with it because I'm not good at transposing. The very thought of you. That's the key of I, right? The key of I? It's probably in a bad key because these, no, these books are nailed. No, keys. that's good. Yeah. That's okay. That's fine. I can do that one. I'll make up. Uh, are you I'm good? making up a little intro. Oh, okay, perfect. It's also how the piano you know, players are the songs. You're very good. You're good at sight reading. I'm not. I have to have heard a song. Have fooled least, me. I have to at least know how the song's supposed to go. Because I can't count. I don't understand why bread and butter is over there, but there's bread and butter. I don't need to sing it. That's my bread and butter. Oh, that's why. Oh, that's why. Because it's on your feed. Because piano is not my bread and butter. I have to keep. I have to keep a plate of it next to me. <laughs> It's your queen. It's my ketchup. <laughs> Ready? Ready. <laughs> the very thought of you. And I forget to do.
she was singing it to the dog. The dog was the inspiration. You could tell. Sounded like she meant it. Right? It's a good thing the dog can give you that. Yeah. She's got a little You want to do another one? You want to find another song? Yeah, here, look for one in this book. It's bigger. It's bigger. This, this book has bigger print. Yeah, try this one. Thank you. 
it's amazing. I'll, I'll try it. I'll try it. Okay. okay. Is that the yeah. tempo you want, or how? Yeah. That's what that That's fine. Okay. We're starting at the refrain. Perfect. We all should start at the refrain. Yeah. I'm trying to use that word a lot so that I... Refrain. Right. So you hold, so you hold yeah. back? I, always, I never... Please, refrain. Yeah, I never... Please. Refrain. I don't know what I, the, the main part was I calling it. I don't know. Chorus. Yeah. It's like chorus. The, part, the, the part everyone the knows. Chorus. The chorus? Is it the chorus? The part everyone knows. Is it the chorus? Is it the chorus? Is like it the, the, the chorus. 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 The The chorus. The chorus. The I didn't know there was going to be a test tonight. This is very hard. Well, this is lounge academy. Okay, I'm we try to make it somewhat educational. People are watching after Can all. Can I turn it in next Good week? Lord. I know the answers. Kids don't try this out. I'll, I'll follow you. My funny Valentine.
great song. I'm going to write a song like that. Good job, Rosie. Good job, Rosie. Okay. Nice work, Valentine. Nice work. Beautiful. something from Shaft.
It is. It's a yeah. Dewey decimal system. Okay. <laughs> so it's 32.86 oh. <laughs> AB. No. I never knew how to use it. I, I would go down to the library just to hang out at those drawers. Those drawers are great, though. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you felt smart. <laughs> of course, I always have to have a librarian next to me <laughs> how to do it. Dan and Suzanne sat I don't nice. understand. I don't understand this song. <laughs> <laughs> it's the to Otherwise, I'm singing. Earl Drake drinks are okay. They break the ice. Dancing this way is also nice. But why delay the friendliest thing two people can do? If you are afraid of strings attached, and you like being you know, awake attached, then it can be the friendliest thing to do. And they tell me about the shuffle board. Some fellas take most of it, some ladies take most of it. Why did you think that? Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. I've been through stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, y
Gertrude yeah. Lawrence, ladies and gentlemen. And there you have it. Yeah, she didn't say anything <laughs> like that. Okay. I'll bet. Gertrude Lawrence. This is my one. Is <laughs> what do you say after a song like that? Is this? This is my blue moon, isn't it? Yeah. Well, the, this is my the poetry blue moon, just continues. Right? <laughs> it's all warm. Where's my beer? Hey, there's another cold one right here. Yeah. Okay, Mary Kate, should we do do one of our numbers? Come on, Mary. Yeah. 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 yeah, Mary. Some of the stuff from the Catskills. Oh, I love that time with yeah. us. Yeah. But nobody puts baby in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> we could do a bracelet. Yeah. That's a nice Chris. one. It is. I was just talking about that one. I'm going to do it from here, though, so that we can you have can, eye contact. You're, you can, yeah. I just need the eye contact power. Yeah. Do you need a mic? Yes, okay. no. No, I don't. She doesn't need anything. <laughs> She's got the bear. I know that is a little weird. Yeah. 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 Do you do the top part? <laughs> Which, how does this sound? The verse? Yeah, well, how that's called the, the verse. Intro. Yeah, that's the intro. That's the verse. The intro verse, right. Yeah. Or verse, yeah. I know that. Yeah. Yeah. Probably yeah, nobody know. knows this. No. I'll do it. Okay. Dozens of girls would storm up. I had to lock my door. That's what Rich sings. Somehow I couldn't warm up to one before. What was it that controlled me? The scene, lady, listen to the rhythm of my heartbeat, and you'll get just what I mean. Embrace me, my sweet embrace. Embrace me. Respectable here. 
See that, ladies and gentlemen? Yeah. The jury. <laughs> what else did we used to do? What's your, what's your favorite Jocko song, Howard? I mean... Well, you were, I mean, you were, his, you were his, one of his very favorite people on the planet. Mm -hmm. the and you've, you've recreated the ambiance and atmosphere that Jock created. Yes. Oh, thank you're, you. You're carrying the torch. So, what's your favorite Jock song? Oh, boy. Well, let's see. Well, so I mean, we've been we've been we've been doing them. You know, it's such a tough question. You know, the favorite song kind of thing. It's like it's like it changes like whatever song you're thinking about that that's you know that's doing it. Yeah, in in the moment, you know, there's a favorite song. You know? We'll find we'll find a. It's like comfort and it's one of my favorites. It's like there's so many. <laughs> Pick another one, Mary Kate. Give me a couple suggestions, Howard. All right, we'll see. Just turn to it. It's not. Hi, Daddy. I'm Richard. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Richard. Sellers. How are you? Queuing me. <laughs> the way you wear your hats. The 
way you hold your dog <laughs> The memories of all that No, no, they can't clean up the rug after that <laughs> You sing off key, the way you haunt my dreams. No, no, you can't take that away from me. We can never my life. That's his awesome. lyric. Right, Barbara Fisher. You ain't heard nothing yet. She must have left Target by now. It wasn't oh, was like, like here's here's the show. Yeah, it was. So she was talking. It was like was very intimate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we thought you you got her yes. thought when she would go. Yes. Time after time. Oh, yeah, she was so good. Yeah, that was such a real yeah firsthand story. To and with that. <laughs> okay. Now after that setup. There's the setup. It's so good luck to you. Is that, <laughs> is that comedy? No. I thought. Hmm? Comedy rewrite time after time. It's uh, Jewel Stein and uh, Sammy Kahn. Oh, okay. yeah. oh, Sammy Kahn. Okay. They're the ones that said that. Maybe we could do it together. You do it, and I'll, if I hear the. If I hear the thing, I'll do it. That's all. We will be breaking
the TikTok at the end? Yeah. Okay. Just want to make sure that everyone got that because you know, it was so clever. songs just from going through these, over these books over the years. Oh. 
Dawning, sleepy and yawning, still the taste of wine. Then I remember your mind, and I've got a world that's fine. What's before me? Routines that bore me. Punch the clock at eight. What a lucky guy I am I've got a world that's great Adam Bonds Cape Canaveral and false alarms Half the universe is up in arms So I flip a little too Until I'm with you What's the hassle? I'll buy the castle We can live like candy if you remember your mind then I've got a world that you've got a world that we got a world that swings I'd like to take you on a wild wonderful adventure fly like a kite from space no strings I don't want to lose that bell that rings cause I've got a world that swings I've got the world on a string Sitting on a rainbow, tied the string around my finger. String reminds me of my neck. I've got a world that sways. Adam Bonds, Cape Canaveral, and false alarms. Half the universe is up in arms. So I flip a little too until I'm holding you. What's the hassle? I'll buy the castle. We can live like kings. If you remember your mind then, I've got a world that, you've got a world that we've got a world that swings. We've got a world that swings. We've got a world that swings. There was uh, Jerry Lewis and the Nutty Professor doing, doing his Buddy Love. I'm not. I'm not sure because they. It's like they stole half of it, right? Yes, yes, yes. That's in Yeah. Yeah. I love it. It was great. You know when he's the nerd in the movie and the kids shut him in the drawer. He's in the drawer and he's going, "Class is dismissed." You may go.
Thank you for making tonight special. Hope we see you again soon at Lounge Academy. Good thinking. Tina's out there. Tina's out there. She lives in a schoolhouse. We got to do her song. These are, you know how you can tell these are professional. We got it like 28 degrees in here and nobody's like. Are you kidding? This is my comfort zone. That's yeah, right. Yeah, this is, this is great. It. You got it covered. I have been cold in 36 years. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. This one's going to be for Tina. She's still. Tuned in, she was a little while ago. Because she goes in the schoolhouse. Right up the street. Where is it? Maybe we won't do it. Take this opportunity and here we go. This one's for Tina. Tina and Terry. This is what she's singing to Terry right now. Did you say I've got a lot to learn? Don't you think I'm trying not to learn? Since this is the perfect spot to learn, teach me tonight. Starting with the ABCs of it, right down to the XYZs of it, help me solve the mysteries of it, teach me. Take that star to write I love you a thousand times across the sky. One thing's very clear, my love. Should the teacher stand so near, my love? Graduation's almost here, my love. Teach me
teach Terry and Tina tonight in this school house. Thank you. And Dr. Terry and Tina, two great lounge cadets. That's in support of you, kids, but you can't pass Dr. And Daryl's out there. Nice to see you, Daryl, sir. Another Floridian. It's impossible Tell the sun yeah. in the sky It's just impossible It's impossible Ask a baby not to cry It's just impossible the seconds that I never think of you or oh, how impossible and the ocean keep from rushing to the shore it's just impossible if I had you could I ever ask for more? It's just impossible. And tomorrow, if you ask me for the world, somehow I get it. I would sell my very soul. Forget it. Live without your love is just impossible, impossible, impossible. Goes out to Barbara Fisher. So many great songs, aren't there, Mary? I'll show you. I text them, and it's like, do you have a favorite that you'd like to sing and like to play? What's well, kind of a, you know, favorite de jour kind of thing? What is you, your favorite today? This day? Of the day? <laughs> song of the day? The, this one. Song of the day. Oh, the one you get. One on the top here. Take it from the top. Ready? Do it together. Love is funny or it's sad or it's quiet or it's mad. It's a good thing or it's bad but beautiful I had the craziest dream yeah. last night. 
Yes, I did. I never dreamt it could be. But there she was in love with me. I saw your lips next to mine. So I kissed them. You didn't mind it at all. When I'm away, such a break never happens. How long can a guy go on dreaming? If there's a chance that you care. next to mine so I kissed him you didn't seem to mind it at all when I'm away Somebody to do something. I don't know. I think it all depends on the time. So oh, I'll sing with me. It runs yeah. out after a certain amount of time. Oh, it's quiet. Yeah. Sometimes we get it through to the national anthem. Oh, it's bad. It's okay. You know, it's a good thing. Right. I think if it ended earlier, it might have a little bit of kind of talking, but it just doesn't seem to be good. Can you do it in F? See, that's the right answer. I think that's 
So you like like C? Yeah. 
I guess it depends on where they put them. I like to try to stay above an S below middle C to like a B flat if I can. So as long as the melody is kind of like in there, then I'll find a key that kind of works. As long, you know, find the highest note of the melody and the lowest note of the melody, and then try to fit it somewhere in that range, and then pick a key that is simpler for most people to play. That's usually how I do it. Like from here? I'm, I mean, no. or, or really yeah, middle here, C? Here, F below middle C. That's pretty low. La, but I sang down here tonight. La, la, the to, I try to fit the melody. I there. see. La, but I can go higher. I mean, it's just that once it starts going higher, that starts getting. This oh, one's in there. A foggy day. Um, in one in town. Had me low. I feel the morning. Oh, then you're way up here. Yeah. Flavor. That's what happens. That's flavor. It starts when it starts getting high. You start losing the the relax. That's like so the twenties or something. Back in the day, right, they used to, to do get, that. Yeah, it starts to get like so high. I'm like, you got a little judgy case about it. Yeah. Not that I can't do it. I just feel like it, it doesn't feel well, relaxed. They do. They do. As they do as relaxed they, as I know they do make these books for female. Keys. Yeah. There's a Mari Ball one. Dancing in the dark. To the tune and we're dancing in the dark. And it soon ends. We're waltzing in wonder of why we're here. Time hurries by, we're here and gone. I stumped you with that one, didn't I? I don't know that one. Pizza Schwartz. Come on, this is family show. Need the shorts, Sorry. <laughs> Forgot we're on TV. <laughs> Hi, Greg Evans. <laughs> oh, not Greg Evans. Greg Evans is on California Time. Oh, Usually comes in off. around now, and he's got watches us on his 62-inch TV set. Isn't okay. that amazing? What the heck is a it, It's like the size of my piano. It's like yeah. the piano would be like <laughs> scale, one-to-one -one scale. Is it on his wall? Has he scheduled our visit? I do not know. I didn't ask him where. It, I didn't want to get... You know. Well, you just never know where, where that's going to lead. I don't believe in fretting or grieving. Why mess around with strife? A cottage small is all. I do a buffalo accent. I'm after. Cottage. One that's spacious and wide. House that rings with joy and laughter. And the one. Some like the high road, I like the low road, free from the care and strife. Sounds corny, yes indeed. Simple 
I like the simple life. He did. He did. He missed him. I did. They went to uh, to see Mark. 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 Somebody. Mark. And I'm just too tired of him. Which is good. I like getting into this zone because then I could do a song like this. Yeah. Mark. No. What does he play? He plays bass or guitar? She was too good to me. played in two sharps in like years. <laughs> You're sharp enough to make it happen. Introducing you a new song? Mary tested a, a, a version of it more oh, recently. It's so hilarious. It so funny. Oh my god, it was so funny. Yeah, normally it's like a more up tempo, but yeah. Kind of a bouncy. to swing it to a little bit.
Where somebody waits for me. Sugar sweet. Bye bye. Chinatown, my Chinatown. Is that San Francisco or New York? 
doesn't say. I believe it's Sutton. It might be Toronto. Yeah, they have. They have one, don't they? Yeah, they do. Let's go. California, USA. Flower drum style. Flower drum San Francisco. I'm going to talk Sunday, sweet Sunday. Okay, now we'll start this stack. Is that this, this one? This looks like old homework you didn't turn in. It is. It's all paperwork. There's that's paperwork and exactly everything I do. That's exactly how all my math homework looks like in high school. Yeah. My math homework looked like something in the circle we did. But mine was like that, but I got straight A's. And oh. my sister sat right next to me, and all of her, hers was all completely neat and completely color coordinated and organized. And I always be here by like two. Oh, man, that's funny. <laughs> I was terrible at that, and the nuns always said it was funny. Oh, that's so funny. But she was so organized. They recorded it in Shirley's living room, like in the like Melody Leibowitz. Yeah. Their her father gave Jocko the piano. Oh, okay. Wow. Eddie De Green. No, Eddie De Green. That was. Because he brought his own no, that's piano. not his piano. Eddie De Green. Must have been before. Wow. Yeah. Is that the one with the mirrors all over it? It was? His, his Jocko Supper Club. Yeah. Oh, okay. Where Andy I've seen pictures of it. Where Andy English came in. What an awesome thing. Oh, we lived there. We totally lived there. We'd wow. go after shows and he would sing. You know, see, he wouldn't sing Opus 1 until we got here because we loved it so much. Opus 1, just like that. Yeah. Wow. Uh, it looked 
like, was it like you'd go in and go down into the basement or something? No, it was one floor, but, but Ann English came in for the big numbers from the kitchen where it was an echo sound and she had a cordless mic, so she would do the phantom stuff starting there and Jocko would look at us and go and do his high register. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is the song I sang with in the 80s. Oh, oh really? Yeah. I met, um, I worked at the computer store and Joe Jambra worked there part time. Yeah. And so he's like, oh, I'm saying you should come and see, oh. come and see Jack Jocko. So he brought me in. But here's the deal. Jackie didn't allow anyone to sing with him that didn't pass his criteria. Yeah. Nobody, nobody just went and, you know, sang with Jackie maybe Jocko. Because of, maybe because Joe was there. No, but I'm saying is that that you did that yeah. is huge. Okay. Yeah, because you passed. Yeah, well, that's not surprising. But, yeah, what song that, was that? I could have danced all night. Oh. Came out pregnant and then sang, I could have danced all night. I should have, no, she said, I should have. I should have danced all night. What a way to ruin a song forever. That's all you think about, right? It takes them like five seconds. wanted it all we wanted it all passion without pain sunshine without rainy days we wanted it always the sky the limit was high never giving in knowing we could win the prize I should have seen it in your eyes
that we almost made it, but we wanted it all. Baby, you and me, we wanted it You and me. Yeah. We weren't like the rats. Yeah, we're in that up, uh, a Melody Leibowitz this one's just for me. video of Jocko doing that in her living room. And I was like, what a great song. Yeah. And then I asked Jocko about it. He did this amazing job with it, but he had music in front of him, so apparently it wasn't like one of his, one of his songs. You know, like maybe it was just... So at the Hyatt, I said... You know, what about that song, you know, You and Me? He says, I don't do that song. I said, I, <laughs> I, said, I saw you doing it, you know. He, he didn't remember. Wow, he did amazing. Well, when you think of the his interpretation of songs he knew. But he did it so, ad. but he did it like, like it was written for him. But it was just so good. You're and right, Howard, he just, but everything he wrote, he, you felt that it was organically Jocko. It was genuine, it was... Uh, conversational, it wasn't presentational, it was conversational. Yeah, I, that's as many yeah. Yeah. old words that I could use. But it, but everything he did was just authentic. I never felt that he was a performer. As much as I hate using those, or I don't even use two, just twice. My left hand's busy. My left hand is busy. <laughs> But when he when he performed or when he sang, it just was like he was. Every song he did was he was he had, he felt as though he had been singing it his whole life. Like he just knew it so well inside out that it was yeah. so organic, you know, just yeah, through so authentic. Yeah, yeah, that's. So whether he truly knew it's it a well good or not, description. It's, it sounds like he did. Yeah. Yeah, he could. Just like pour it through that channel. When I would, when I would walk into Jocko's and it was the supper club, he, I walk in and Jocko would start singing a bunch of songs. It was like the narrative of Conal Mini was He did that to many people. But every time I walked in there, it's like I knew what I was going to walk into. And I was sort of preparing and fortifying myself because. Yeah, you'd be I announced. Get, I get embarrassed. Yes, I know what you mean. I'm really yeah, you'd be announced I'm, to the crowd, yeah, and you, like, you don't. Despite know what yeah, I yeah. do, I'm an introvert. Yeah, yeah, I understand. But it was always good. It was always yeah loving and authentic. Yeah, even and, if you kind of winced going. Yeah, there was some. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. right. Yeah. Yes. Oh, he wasn't doing sweet. it. He wasn't yeah. doing it. Embarrassing. Oh yeah, no, he was doing it to love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he might not be comfortable with it. Absolutely. Yeah. Probably they are off. I'm gonna freeze. I gotta, I gotta head out. Yeah, me too. Oh, I can imagine how we went. I was gonna start my second set. Second set. This is gonna be so funny. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thank she did a lot of places, but you were the best at the house. Did you bring your mom? Boy, did he have a good time there. Carol, somewhere. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
My journey's ended. It's a funny thing. I look at you. I get a thrill. I never knew. Isn't it a pity? We never met before. Ever hear this one? Well, then I wrote it. Here we are at last. It's like a dream. The two of us. A perfect team. Isn't it a pity we never met before? Imagine all the lonely years we've wasted. You with the neighbors. Happiest of men, I'm sure to be if only you would say to me, Isn't it a pity we never met before? The, the verse. Okay. It's a funny thing. What if you sing it and knock it down? How weird does that sound? Well, you, you do it. I'll, I'll sing the harmony. I don't know if I'll hear any of this, but we'll try. Isn't it a 
There's one you must do. Now this looks like it's in a horrible key for you, right? No, that's fine. But I'm just yeah. saying, you're trying to be able to determine yeah. it. That's not bad. It goes up to here, which would be like...
Summer smiles. The summer knows. Unashamed, she picks her nose. Summer smooths the restless sky. Lovingly, she warms the sand. On which you lie, the summer knows. The summer's wise sees the doubt. No, we're just, we we're kind of an extended time. I mean, it's an extended, it was, a, it's the Bravo time. These big stars, time. people it's want to stay up all night and watch. A kid, it's a lesson I learned cool. from my life when I was a kid. I wanted a polo stick for a while because my friends had a polo, mm -hmm. polo stick. And I, I wanted my own as opposed to just always using theirs. And my parents said, well, you watch the swap shape for a little bit. And oh, the swap shape? Like wow. and, and in other words, you just kind of wait it out. And eventually, I lost interest in it. Right, oh, right. Now I still kind of kept that lesson. Every, I, I always, I got that personality where I want something. Sometimes at one point, and I kind of tell myself, "Well, you know what? Just mm -hmm. kind of watch for a little while. See if it goes on sale." Commercially, that guy. You know how the time you're, you know, goes late away. Go skateboarding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's skateboarding. So I bought my nephew. Oh, it's like too late, too late. I bought my nephew George a pogo stick. He lie down until and he was like the king of the <laughs> king of the hill. You know. Those are fun. Those yeah. things. But I mean, yeah. I just kept using my friend's pogo stick, and that was all right. <laughs> right, right, right. Isn't that fun? No, you didn't. Boy, I'm surprised they're still legal, even for someone else. Is this yours, Mary Kate? <laughs> this is yours, right? Yes, it is. Yes. Cat. But they're still so allowed. This is the book. Fell out of the bag. Maybe. 
thank you so much. You're welcome. You're so welcome. We need a picture of the ladies. Yeah, I can, I just Smile, everybody. Where's Rosie? Gotta get Rosie. She's on my lap. She's on oh. the sleeping mode. Yeah, she's right. next time. Mary's lap. You get this thing to cooperate. She's a cute dog. You're a cute dog, Rosie. <laughs> There's a little more for her to tell. Rosie's so funny, she just catches a nap and whatever laugh she happens to be having. Yeah, she's oh, nice. We, had a, we were at a fundraiser at Giancarlo's last night, oh. and these people, um, not from the organization, but from the restaurant, said, mm, is it Rosie? And I no, Rosie. I've taken her there a couple times, but I didn't Rosie. think she impacted people that they knew her name. Yeah. And I said, yeah, it is. And then this one little boy oh, comes so up and said, aren't you Katie Cook's aunt? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am. Nice. Yeah. That's so great. I know. I know. Rosie's getting a little celebrity. Oh, Erd. Oh, Erd. Can you give me Rich Kelman's yeah. autograph? Yeah. Oh, I know. Yes, I do. Come on, Phoebe. Yes. I keep them long so that they're. I love them. Oh, look. Oh, she loves the harmonica. She's looking up. Ooh. That's Rich playing harmonica. Who's that? Yeah, all of a sudden she woke up. Rich, you're yes. making her do her cute little dog <coughs> video. Because it hurts her ears. Her, his own she watched this. <coughs> she watched oh. No, they it hurts her ears. What? I had a dog. <laughs> like it? Harmonicas hurt their ears. <laughs> yeah, they cry. She's not going to cry. She perked up the no? way that. Yeah. She's Frequency. not a crier. No? Frequency's high pitch. Yeah, there's something <laughs> about it. Something about harmonica. Because we had a dog. Sharp pitch. Play harmonica and she started crying, you know. And, oh, wow. it's like, and it's, well, I can't thank you enough for another oh, amazing you for evening. Well, yes, thank you. Thank you. So we so should here. Really but let's talk about the Okama Life. Yeah, we'll probably do like a little yeah. fundraiser here. Oh. Come on, puppy. Okay. <laughs> she's also knows when she's when you're going yeah. home. Yeah, she can. Puppy. There. Oh, oh. In here. She has a little doll. She goes into her holder. Thanks, everybody. We, we wanted to extend it time. We normally go till 11, and it's, uh, and it's 12.06. We, oh, we went an hour and six minutes over. Oh. 
because, uh, yeah, thanks, Gregory. It is past my bedtime. We wanted it all, Barbara. I didn't want to jip you guys because we had some great performers here tonight. Um, Mary Kate O'Connor and uh, Katie Miner, and they yeah. were they were like you know doing songs and harmonies and everything. How great! So, the and Ro, and little Rosie, four-legged Rosie. Okay, we'll we'll turn you loose until next week. Thanks, uh, thanks a lot. This was a, what a, really a five-hour show tonight. I'm ready to eat my chicken wing that I've been saving. Thanks, everybody. See you next week, next Friday.